Hello and welcome. This is lesson 153 of Learn Hindi Through English and in this lesson we will learn about present perfect tense sentences in passive form. Okay, that is has been and have been plus verb in its third form in English. Okay, for this sentence structure we will be using these in Hindi. Gaya hai, gaya hai for masculine singular, gaye hai, gaye hai for masculine and plural, gai hai, gai hai for feminine singular and gai hai, gai hai for feminine plural. Okay. Now let us look at few examples and try to understand how to convert or translate them to Hindi. Okay. So coffee has been made. Coffee has been made. All right. Now, first step is to recognize the verb in the sentence. Made. So make or here in this case prepare. So this in Hindi is bana. Bana. Okay. So the past form of make is made. Prepare is prepared. Now made or prepared has four forms. Banaya for masculine singular. Banaye for masculine plural. Banayi for masculine, sorry, feminine singular. And banayi for feminine plural. And then we have our words or suffixes from here. Okay. Gaya hai, gaye hai, gai hai and gai hai. Now, coffee has been made coffee is coffee itself coffee this is feminine in hindi subject coffee is feminine in hindi so after this there is no post position so according to the gender of this we will be selecting this and this so this is feminine feminine and we consider this as singular coffee this is for feminine and singular banai so coffee banai banai and then for feminine singular we have gai hai gai hai so coffee banai gai hai so coffee is coffee banai gai hai is has been made okay next the tax has been paid the tax has been paid so pay pay is bhugatan kar bhugatan kar in hindi bhugatan kar in hindi so paid past form of pay is bhugatan kiya bhugatan kiye bhugatan ki or bhugatan ki now this is for masculine singular this is for masculine plural this is for feminine singular and this is for feminine plural okay and then we have our suffixes or the words with which we end the sentences okay gaya hai for masculine singular gaye hai for masculine plural gai hai for feminine singular and gai hai for feminine plural okay now kar kar is tax okay kar is tax so here also you can see kar but this is part of verb so kar means do kar means do it is verb and kar is also uh, a part of conjunct verb conjunct verb kar verbs we know about that so kar has one more meaning which is tax okay kar has one more meaning which is tax kar ka Kar ka. So, ka is post position. So, we have post position after subject. So, now see if this is a noun conjunct verb or adjective conjunct verb. Now, this is noun conjunct verb and bhugatan is masculine in Hindi. Masculine in Hindi, it means payment. Okay. It is masculine in Hindi and according to this, we will be selecting this and this. Okay. So, Bhugatan is uh, masculine and so Bhugatan Kia, Bhugatan 
किया एंड फॉर मैस्कुल सिंगुलर वी हैव गया है गया है कर का भुगतान किया गया है कर का भुगतान किया गया है कर का द टैक्स भुगतान किया गया है हैज बीन पेड ओके नेक्स्ट वी हैव फ्यू मोर एग्जांपल्स द वेडिंग हैज नॉट बीन कैंसल्ड द वेडिंग हैज नॉट बीन कैंसल्ड शादी रद्द नहीं की गई है शादी रद्द नहीं की गई है शादी इज वेडिंग रद्द कर रद्द कर इज कैंसल ओके नहीं इज नॉट रद्द नहीं की गई है इज हैज नॉट बीन कैंसल्ड ओके हैज द स्पीच बीन डिलीवर्ड हैज द स्पीच बीन डिलीवर्ड क्या भाषण दिया गया है क्या भाषण दिया गया है क्या इज अ वे ऑफ क्वेश्चनिंग इन हिंदी ओके इट इज इक्वल टू हैज बीइंग इन द इनिशियल पोजीशन और फर्स्ट पोजीशन भाषण भाषण दे ओके भाषण दे इज डिलीवर स्पीच और इन अदर वर्ड्स भाषण इज स्पीच दे इज डिलीवर ओके दे इज डिलीवर दिया गया है इज बीन डिलीवर्ड अलोंग विथ हैज हैज बीन डिलीवर्ड दिया गया है दिया गया है हैज बीन डिलीवर्ड बट हैज इज इन द फर्स्ट पोजिशन और एट द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द सेंटेंस सो वी हैव एडेड क्या इन हिंदी ओके भाषण इज स्पीच एंड इट इज मैस्क्यूलिन एंड सो द सफिक्स आर सेलेक्टेड सो हियर शादी इज फेमिनिन एंड सो रेस्ट ऑफ द वर्ड आर सेलेक्टेड अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट हैज शी नॉट बीन पॉइजनड हैज शी नॉट बीन पॉइजनड क्या उसे जहर नहीं दिया गया है क्या उसे जहर नहीं दिया गया है उसे शी जहर ओके जहर पॉइजन दे इज गिव ओके हियर जहर दे इज पॉइजन वर्ब ओके जहर इज पॉइजन नाउन जहर दे इज पॉइजन वर्ब ओके नाउ जहर इज मैस्किलिन and it decides rest of the suffixes zeher nahi diya gaya hai has not been poisoned zeher nahi diya gaya hai has not been poisoned but we have has at the beginning of the sentence so adding kya in the beginning of hindi sentence makes this a question okay next what has been written about us in this book what has been written about us in this book is pustak mein hamare bare mein kya likha gaya hai is pustak mein hamare bare mein kya likha gaya hai is is this pustak is book mein is in hamare bare में इज अबाउट अस क्या इज वॉट लिखा गया है इज हैज बीन रिटर्न ओके सो इस पुस्तक में इज इन दिस बुक हमारे बारे में इज अबाउट अस क्या इज वॉट लिखा गया है इज हैज बीन रिटर्न ओके सो दिस इज हाउ यू ट्रांसलेट present perfect tense sentences in its passive form to hindi of course there are few exceptions there are extra rules which are not necessary for you at this stage okay click subscribe click on the bell icon and click on all to get notified when we post a new video if you want to watch more videos click on the channel and 
click on playlists and follow any playlist that you want.